hello welcome back to my channel uh, in this video I'm gonna show you preview of the latest uh, feature on the theme child which I uploaded on my github uh, I'm added the quick view function to show and retrieve the data for uh, each a product on WooCommerce so if a visitor or user click the button it will uh, show the pop-up and inside the pop-up uh, there are uh, data from a WooCommerce hook which you can uh, f uh, read more about it on this website uh, here wokomers.github.io or you can use this uh, website bas uh, businessbloomer.com uh, you can modify the file uh, however you like but <coughs> I will show you the, fo the, the, up the, the file first Okay, here is the temp child files. So, uh, I'm using this uh, function code which I found on stackoverflow.com and I add on I added uh, the f the code, the function code on this file, the quick view.php and here you can customize the, the HTML markup uh, however you like and then you can customize the script interaction and of course you can customize the data uh, which you want to show on the model pop-up here uh, I have a, a, I, a, a, I have I edit the small uh, data from the WooCommerce a single product which is the product short description product name the product price and the product categories and I copy it from this website So uh, how to use that? Uh, it's very simple. You only need to create a custom uh, query loop for product uh, here, and uh, inside the uh, container, the container which has a query loop, uh, <coughs> you need to add a button and add a class name. Uh, the quick view class name because uh, I'm using the class name to uh, initiate the click uh, JavaScript interaction. Mm, wait, let's see here JavaScript on click where is here the quick view class name. So when the button, uh, so when the user click the element which has a quick fill class name, it will trigger the pop up <coughs> and trigger the 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 uh, Ajax which will retrieve data from uh, the product. So the result is like this. Hmm, let's see, Oops. click quick fill. We have a title, we have a price, we have a category of the product, and we have this simple at uh, the sort description. And we have, and oh yeah, I forgot to mention that this is the thumbnail of the product. Let's click another, then with logo, and let's click another. We have uh, another uh, pop-up 
from each product so uh, you can customize uh, the content of the model but you need to uh, learn or read from the website I mentioned uh, wocommerce.com and businessbloomer.com or you can find other uh, website reference to get the hook which uh, you need and oh yeah I forgot to mention that uh, there is uh, there are uh, people who encounter the problem with uh, the expanded grid element on the temp child mm, this element uh, but I have but I cannot reproduce the problem from my end so if you if you have uh, s if you get same problem uh, please uh, comment on uh, please write uh, the error on the comment box below or you can uh, create uh, or add an issue on my github page maybe I can find a solution for the problem uh, so uh, I think uh, that's all I need to tell you if you have any question please write uh, on the comment box below uh, thank you for watching and happy coding